Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I just thought I would show you my Tesco food shop. Um, I've rejoined Slimming World last week. I'll do another video about that, but this is all Slimming World friendly. I'm including Sins. Um, it came to £102. That was including like club card discounts plus my 10% big shop. I'll um, run down the receipt at the end if you want to see individual prices, if that's going to help you. There's quite a few deals on here. I try to pick up the, the club card deals and things. So try to lay it out into like veggies, salad, veg, fruit, fridge items, store cupboards and treats. Yeah, and there's a couple of things on here which aren't for me, but we'll show you them anyway. So starting off, the um, British baby potatoes are on offer this week on a club card deal. So I've got a couple of packs of those. They're obviously free on the plan. But I put nut squash. Um, these are speed. And I use them often if I'm making chips instead. And I'll make them out of butternut squash. I'm saying often when I was on doing something well before and it really helped me get to um, target. It's reducing your carb intake and increasing more speed vegetables. It's a good way of doing that. I try and choose ones which have got a longer sort of um, top part because that's the part that's all flesh. And the bottom bit is usually the bit that's hollow. So like this one, it's a bit of a weird shape. It doesn't look like a traditional butternut squash. But for me, I'm, a, I'm thinking it's probably about this much, which is all good stuff that I can use without the seeds in. Um, I'll show you one time if you want how I prep my butternut squash when I'm making chips. I've got a couple of courgettes. Um, so all these are sort of um, sim free, sort of speedy veg and things. got some asparagus. I think that was not badly priced either um a couple of little gems i've got some leaf leaf salad i'm going to really try and get on plan 100 percent this week and um, picked up some spring onions as well so then speed 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 um i really do prefer that like, the little mini peppers really nice now they did a lot of the things um this week in tesco so i've got like um if you buy sort of two of something you'll save some money or like within like the fruit or the salad or the different vegetables they've got lots of like multi-buy deals on that so do keep an eye out for those um so you've got some sweet mini peppers i love these really really tasty an iceberg lettuce again speed a couple of cucumbers because i get through cucumbers a lot plus my grandson loves cucumbers and you'll have like a quite often like a plate full of just chopped up cucumber so we <laughs> get through a lot of that and then I've got to treat myself to some sweet mixed baby tomatoes a little bit more expensive but they're really yummy and yeah because I'm going to have a lot of salads so I just thought I'd just spoil myself this week and um, some radishes and um, chestnut mushrooms I really like the chestnut mushrooms now take care if you do do mini chestnut mushrooms which actually Per 100 gram and almost double the price so make sure if you're looking for chestnut mushrooms that you pick up the sort of regular size ones rather than the mini ones if that's what you're sort of just looking for if you're not bothered it's a lot <laughs> a lot extra if you get the mini ones by mistake i think they look in the same size product um but yeah when, when you look at price per 100 grams really not a good deal at all a couple of conference pairs and their speed so the jazz apples this week are on offer, so I picked those up. I, I really like Braeburns normally, um, but I like any sort of apple like this, sort of jazz, you know, the Empire, Pink Ladies. So whatever's like the most reasonably priced is what I'll pick up. The Satsumas were on a club card deal again this week as well. Watermelon, um, this really helps me. <laughs> Um, with good weight losses, but not squash and watermelon. If I buy those, I do seem to have good weight losses. Try and just have a little bowl of this on an evening if I'm wanting a sweet snack. And like you can feel like a dessert bowl full of like chopped up watermelon. And it's really sweet. It's mainly water, <laughs> very low in calories. And then um, honestly, it just, it fills you. It satisfies that sweet craving. So yeah. Um, I picked up some nectarines. I've not had these in ages. So, um, yeah, the ripen at home ones. So I'm obviously going to need the bananas that will help ripen them up. And yeah, it's so, so long since I've had them. But again, they're on the club card deal, so I've picked those up. Got my bananas. These are a free food, not speed. Um, strawberries. The, um, they had some other ones, which won a better deal. These are the cheaper ones, and they look nicer. So I just picked up the cheaper strawberries. They are the British ones, so they just taste 
really gorgeous and um, so yeah love, love love strawberries and um, got some green grapes love those as well um so i got these for my grandson it's just some smoothies i got their own brand ones cheaper than the sort of um oh gosh what is it what are the other smoothies called you know which ones i mean anyway oh, i can't think of what they're called anyway they're a lot cheaper and um just as nice the penne pasta is um free now on swimming world same as regular pasta which is great the fresh pasta used to have to sin um so this is quite good because it's only it's in a much smaller bag than what you get in the morrisons so i think these are this is 300 gram bag i think the morrisons ones are 500 so it's much easier for portion control there's just the two of you eating that um now do you know i've never had feta cheese is that not bizarre so i've picked up the tesco's version because obviously it's a lot cheaper and um, so this is just the reduced fat salad cheese um i've lost my sharpie so i've got different pens so i hope you can make it out but basically 65 grams of this is a healthy a choice so that's not bad because here it tells you per 30 grams so you're basically getting double that but yeah if, if you struggle to use like both of your healthy a's add some cheese in so i'm going to maybe have some like to stop salads just try those see what i think i have got my baby bells these are great for a grab and go three of these are a healthy a and these are really nice on the night you make a little snack plate up having some of your mini baby bells these are the mini baby bell lights make sure you get the right ones um they weren't on the offer but i really wanted them um so yeah they're nice for like an apple some of this and just like a little couple of bits and pieces maybe a yogurt or something else and then i've picked up some reduced fat mozzarella it's always handy to have in and 70 grams of this is a healthy a just make sure that when you look at the back it says 240 grams but that's for the full amount without including all the water in there so once you've like just got the ball of mozzarella out you'll be left with 125 grams of that so basically um, over half of it is a healthy air so I don't think that's bad especially because I tend to um, make this on my um, like pasta ragu bake and um, it goes between like four five six portions even so it's, um, it's a really good way it melts gorgeous if you can't get this reduced fat mozzarella the mini baby bell lights melt really really well to be honest if you slice them up thinly and then pop on top of a pasta dish they melt in really nice, don't seem plasticky, and you get that kind of like gooey cheese, like you know, sort of stringy cheese that you get on pizzas and things. So it's a good way maybe for your um, pizza top chicken or just on top of your regular pastas or pasta bakes. Um, you can use that as a mozzarella substitute, I think. Um, so I've got some reduced fat coleslaw. So it's three and a half sins for 100 grams, which I don't think is bad, actually. Um, and it says there that a quarter of a pack is 50 grams so basically half of that is three and a half sins so you can get a really good spoonful really can't you so there's that um got some lean free lean free i've just had a text from my husband hang on a wee second about that guys i was trying to do it in one go so i could just upload it without having to edit it now i'll have to edit it okay so yeah i've got some five percent um lean steak mint really handy for spag balls chilies um loads of recipes on the slim world website so make your own burgers meatballs whatever you want but yeah it's just always handy to have in i've um, got some little pomegranates just to add on to my salad just to make it a bit more interesting um yeah, so semi skim milk, just some eggs, complete staple. Uh, it, you know, eggs are just going up and up and up, aren't they? But I still can't, I have to buy free range. I cannot bring myself to, burn, to buy barn eggs. I mean, if you do, that's absolutely fine. For me, I just can't. I'll just pay the extra and get free range. Um, got some chicken breast slices, handy for sandwich or your salad, or just even adding off your tea. Um, free. I've got some smoked bassa fillets. I actually wanted haddock, but it's so expensive again. Um, but I thought this would be really nice for a lunch or my tea one night. Um, there's two big fillets in there. Um, really reasonably priced, actually, as you'll see at the end. And obviously, these are free, packed full of protein, really low fat. If you can get some fish in, it's a really good thing to add into your diet. Oops, just knocked my pomegranates off. Um, now these, this humongous pack of chicken was a club card deal, so there's what, two, four, six, 
eight chicken breasts in there. Um, nine pounds, absolutely brilliant. I'm gonna just split them up and bob them in the freezer. So obviously they're free, packed full of protein, really, really good buy to have. Um, some Muller Lights. So these are, I like these flavour. Well, I'm not like quinoa and strawberry, but maybe make them into overnight oats. But I love cherry, love raspberry and cranberry. Again, yogurts are another thing that's getting really expensive. So these are usually about half a spin per pot. Um, just some Passata. This is price matched to Aldi. Um, I think it was 69 pence. Um, their own one was 60 pence. So I thought I'd rather just pay the extra nine pence and get the Napolina. Um, Haribo, just for my grandson's little sweetie pot. Now it was, um, no, 25 grams was, what was it, about four and a half since I can't see now. It all, looks like it's rubbed off. Anyway, it was a lot. <laughs> Basically just sugar, isn't it? Um, oh, I forgot to scan these. I will add it down below if I remember in the pinned comment. But anyway, 54 calories per slice, they're really high um, in sins, they're gonna be. So you're looking at about two and a half sins per slice. And then each pack has three slices for me. It's just not worth it. But if that's what you want, you can have them. I'm just gonna take these in these pack ups all out on the night. So I've got the forest fruit flavor and the raspberry. These are just like a pound for the five packs. So like 15 slices in total. And um, crunches, and um, six sins per little crunchy. I love these soft pitters. They're really, really lovely. So these are wholemeal, so they're a healthy bee. Or if you want to send them, they're seven and a half cents each. You literally can stuff them full <laughs> of like salad, whatever you want, like really nice for breakfast with bacon, egg and mushroom shoved in there as well, or sausages. Just so versatile and um, yeah, they're really, really gorgeous. Nice and squishy soft. Make sure you pick up the wholemeal ones because they do do white. Um, brioche buns, these are for my son. He likes to make his own sort of chicken burgers. But these are eight sins per roll. So they're quite high sins. And you can't use them as a healthy feed because there's really not enough um, whole grains in there at all. Um, I've got these, oh, and I forgot to scan this, but I'm pretty sure these are a healthy bee. I will check. Oh, gosh, I'm so sorry. I should have checked this. I will write this definitely down below or on the screen. Um, I've got these for my grandson. I'm not a massive Weetabix fan, but I think I might try and maybe make like, um, like I don't like a ch overnight sort of cheesecakey thing and use this as a base or just see if I do like them as it's a way of getting more fibre in. Um, I will let you know how many sins are in those. 12 servings, isn't many, is it in the box? Um, I'm sure it'll be even less than that. It probably should be about, it's about 40 grams or something for a, a cereal. Anyway, I'll let, I'll let you know down below. Um, some chopped tomatoes, just basic stock of items and some tomato puree. Um, beetroot, sliced beetroot just for my husband. Where were we now these, couldn't believe it, so popcorn. So you can get your sweet, you can get the salted, or you can get the sweet and salted. These, 44 calories a pack, two sins a packet. So for me, for my little snack plate on the, plate on the night, um, get my three baby bells, get an apple, get some of this popcorn and my beer yogurt. Happy days. Um, I can't believe that two sins. So if you're struggling with your sins and you just want something like snacky when you're watching telly, Love Island starts next week. This is gonna be perfect. Um, hula hoop puffs, not bad at all. Only three and a half cents per pack. And compare that to these sort of more regular crisps that you would usually sort of get. Their own brand, um, Ready Salted, six and a half cents per packet. Seabrook's six and a half cents per packet as well. So for me, I'm going to be going for these for me and these are for my husband. Um, coffee is on card deal, so five pounds a jar for this. So I've got a regular intense coffee there and then a decaf as well for like um, so after dinner time, after tea, so that we've got that so we can sleep well. They're selling these ones off. Um, my husband prefers the double strength Vimto, so obviously not as sugar, so they're free on the plan. Um, make sure you're drinking plenty of water, sugar-free squash. Um, you might just be thirsty, not hungry, <laughs> so have a drink first, and if you're still hungry, then have a snack, maybe like a speedy snack rather than sins. Um, got some bleach, got some sunscreen, my husband's going away on a golf trip on a Sunday for a few days, and um, we've got some, but it's sort of nearly out in order, but this stuff might be quite good, it dries straight away, so I thought I'd maybe get him that back to 30, because he's got several days out playing golf, so protect his skin. Got some fruit shoots. 
um, for my grandson, got some, just some fruit and then orange. So obviously these are sim free because they are sugar free. Um, it was cheaper buying the packs of four than it was buying a pack of eight, um, just by the way the pricing worked. I've got some little freezer bags just so I can split those chicken breasts up here. And then, um, yeah, I'll just split them up and pop them in the freezer. I can take them out individually as I need. This size should be adequate, I think. So, yeah, um, just some Tesco's washing up liquid. Normally by Fairy. I thought, I'm going to just see what Tesco's is like. I'm sure it's all the same. Um, I generally use the dishwasher. All I use the washing liquid for is just to rinse my drawers out from my Ninja. So, it's barely touching it. It's just to give it a quick wash around. Got some non-scratch kitchen sponges and then finally I picked up the issue of Kitchen Garden magazine because it came out whilst I was away um, on holiday I think or just as I got back so this month there's just 15 packets of seeds inside which is amazing so I'll be doing a separate video showing what seeds are in the um which month is it now for this magazine is it the July one or for the June magazine so yeah I'll let you know for that right make sure there's no details on here that you can see but basically i'm now just going to run down really quickly there we go just so you can see the prices in case there's anything there that you are interested in knowing the price i know it's sometimes you need to just compare different shops to make your money go a little bit further so this is wobbly um, obviously, it's got the prices off for the special deals. Nearly finished. Nearly finished. Where are we? So, yeah, it should have been £130.90. Um, saved like 28 quid altogether. £17 was that was on the club card deals. And then I got 10% off as well, which is an extra sort of 10, 11 quid. And that's it came to 102 pounds which is outrageous isn't it <laughs> so yeah that is everything i've got in this shop i hope it's been useful for you if you'd like to see these please do let me know and i'll be sure to include them my last video did really well it's a little while since i filmed it but i think having the sim values really helps i will add on the fruit slices and the wheat bix is that everything on at the end um yeah so thanks so much for watching guys um i hope you have a great day whatever you're doing and i'll see you all in my next video